What's going on everybody? It's your boy Neezy here. I want to say real quick, thank you for taking time out of your day to watch my video. And if you like what you see here, you want to see more, feel free to like, comment, subscribe for more videos. Can't do it without you guys, so thanks for watching, and I hope you enjoy what you're about to see. With that being said, let's get into the video. A Quiet Place 2. So A Quiet Place 2 is the upcoming sequel to 2018's A Quiet Place, the movie that was just, oh my god, this movie was crazy, I loved it. This movie officially comes out this Friday, and is this movie good? Oh, man, this this movie, this movie's great, I love it. The movie takes everything you love from the first movie and just amps it up even more to get more detail, more world building. It's just the, the, the thought, the idea of this movie is just, is crazy. It's a shame this movie got pushed back because I, I was literally like going to see this movie literally like two days before the world ended in 2020. At my screening pass and everything, I was like, gonna see Quiet Place 2, you yeah, pumped up. Then the movie theater's closed and I was like, ah, the fuck. But now we fast forward a year later and I got to see it last night, oh my God. And it's just incredible and I can't wait to talk to you guys about A Quiet Place Part 2, no spoiler. The movie was great, let's get into it. Look into the protocol of why I believe that A Quiet Place Part 2 is in the theaters officially this Friday. Who would you know about it? Because it's great. Well, I think in the movie, Emily Blunt, she's still she's still awesome. She still kills it. And you still bring that emotion that like, you know, she's in a world where like these creatures, these monsters are still lurking around. You can't like, you know, speak. You can't make no noise or nothing. Because if you knew, it's bad news bears. <laughs> The stuff her and her family have to endure in this movie is just insane, and I just loved it. You've, it's, it's that level of acting attention that just it, it just elevates it for me. It was great. Like, even the two kid actors in the movie too, they were great too. It's like I said, everyone they bring their A game in this movie. There's also some other characters in the movie that I'm not gonna like get into because that's, that's kind of spoiler. Because you do meet more people along the way. Because like I said, the movie is like kind of like The Last of Us too. Where The Last of Us is like okay, it's like this little you know independent single thing, but then it's like part two. Okay, now we're getting out into the world and shit. Well, what's going on? out there. So overall, I think the movie was just fantastic. Loved it. For, okay, plot in the movie. Oh, here we go. Without spoilers, plot in the movie, the fact that, okay, the movie takes place a little bit after the first one, because now it's like, okay, we have to go out to the world and just pretty much see, like, okay, you know, we gotta survive and shit. It's survival horror. But you learn that these creatures are not the only thing in the world that's like, you know, terrorizing shit out there, because there's more big shit out there. I say it's kind of like, think of The Last of Us Part 2, where it's like, okay, it's not just, you know, the monsters and the clickers and shit like that. It's also humanity like, yeah because it's like you're not the only people that you know survive this shit and you do get a glimpse you do see a flashback of how this all happened everything like that you know it's just a normal day everything's happy and then all of a sudden these creatures come down and it's just hell on earth but i do like seeing how it all happened because like i said period movie was like okay we're just in this world where like these creatures just happened they just came and okay they're just here now we gotta deal with it sequel it's like oh now we get to see how it all happened where they came from how it all went down the world just went to hell well seeing that was just so incredible just so tenseful i loved it so much it was great the original movie like i said it does keep that that tension that like oh it's just, just i can't make any sound because if i make sound someone's gonna die i literally just in the theater just like if i'm not eating my popcorn because if i do people are gonna die ah, and it's just so much more character development so much more detail in the movie that just like oh this just elevates everything from the first movie just makes it more deeper more grounded more light levels there's more layers to it like i said you could see everyone's perspective everyone's like deeper like characters it's not just like uh you know oh monster movie monsters just killing people in the words of clover field monsters come in all shape and sizes and forms so yeah it's a movie that's gonna have you just like on your seat just really just like engaged to it from start to finish you're gonna be like well just shit i'm, I'm locked into this movie let's go yeah, and the way these creatures just get on the scene and they just start tearing shit up like i said for that horror enthusiastic in you you're gonna love that too Dude, i can't really say any cause in the movie as fact at all like it just it, was a movie that i was waiting for since last year and i'm glad i got to see it so i'm just gonna say that this movie was just i if something got left the end of the day quiet place 2 was a great movie I had a great time with it the characters movie were great that story was so much more developed and it just takes it into a new like yeah the characters were great the story was great the ending the ending get ready for that it does me great pleasure to say i'm so happy to say this i love this movie so much i'm going to say that a quiet place part two is still a 10 out of 10 which is fucking awesome <laughs> As always, guys, subscribe. Until next time.